Welcome back to Crazy Bill's Garage. And today I'm showing you my new, well, not my new, but my fancy tool here for uh, lubing up or packing bearings. And I have the bearings from, uh, let me see, which one's a bearing? This one's a bearing. Now this is from my uh, new boat trailer that I'm uh, getting all fixed up. And there'll be a video out of me taking the bearings off or taking the wheel hub off and the bearings on this trailer this week. But uh, for this being a Sunday, well, I'm putting this out on a Sunday, I am going to show you my neat tool, which will show you what and how I'm going to pack these bearings. Now, this is a special tool here. They're not expensive, and they pack bearings. And you know you you know the old fashioned way where you put the goop in your hand and you you know do the do that way. Well, I don't want to do that way anymore. And this way I've been actually using for a while, and it seems to work really good. So <laughs> place her in here, get her in the center. You put this on, and you gotta make her nice and tight there in the middle. So, I'm going to make sure this thing is centered in there pretty good to uh, get her in there. And, yeah. and then you're going to use your grease gun to pump in this uh, good old stuff here. And usually these things are self-centering, so it's not that bad. You get her nice and tight. I'm going to move that out of the way, and get a grease gun, which I have here, pop her on there, and you start filling her with grease. Now, I got a bad feeling this grease gun is pretty well out of grease, so I'm going to have to do something about that. So I grabbed my other grease gun, and I can't remember what kind of grease I have in this one, but I bet it's probably close to the right type I need. And I'm going to do that. And this one is oh, there, getting some pressure back. And I'm just going to pump in there until we see the grease coming through. Oh, it's completely through. I guess I pumped in a little more than I need, but I can use it inside the hub there. So, uh, where is my rag? Oh, I need a rag. I always like to wipe this tip off here. It's got all that grease on it and everything, you know. And then, as you can see in there now, grease is everywhere. It has gone through that bearing. So, uh, let me just unscrew it, and there we are. Hmm. Worked very good. I love using this machine. It works good, and as you noticed, I put on some rubber gloves. And there we go. And I just take this grease and I put her on in here. So. There we go. And our bearing is greased. And it seems like everything's good. It all came through. Just place her on in. And I take whatever grease is left in here, pack her in around here before I put the seal on on the back. And there we go. So that's not too hard, is it? You know, it's a lot less work than doing it the old fashioned way, which I could show you, but I'm not. And uh, 
there we go. Uh, it's a very quick job to do it with these little machines. I will, I bought it at Princess Auto. I will look for the part number for you. I'll look on the website and I'll put that in the, in the uh, description. All right, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed this. Just a little Sunday quickie to show you how sometimes it is easier to um, grease your bearings without getting all icky. <laughs>